How does vascular dementia differ from Alzheimer's disease? Have you ever wondered how vascular dementia differs from Alzheimer's disease? These two conditions are the most common types of dementia, but they have distinct causes, symptoms, and progression patterns. Alzheimer's disease is a progressive neurodegenerative disorder. It is characterized by the buildup of abnormal proteins in the brain, specifically beta amyloid plaques and tau tangles. This buildup damages neurons and impairs communication between brain cells. The most noticeable early symptom of Alzheimer's is memory loss. As the disease progresses, individuals may experience difficulties with thinking, behavior, and everyday tasks like cooking or managing finances. Alzheimer's typically progresses gradually and irreversibly, affecting various cognitive functions over time. On the other hand, vascular dementia is caused by reduced blood flow and oxygen supply to the brain. This often occurs due to strokes or other vascular conditions that damage brain tissue. When blood flow is interrupted, it can lead to brain cell injury or death in specific areas. Symptoms of vascular dementia usually include problems with problem solving, slowed thinking, loss of focus, and difficulties with organization. And like Alzheimer's, memory loss may not be the first symptom to appear. In some cases, symptoms can emerge suddenly after a stroke or develop gradually due to cumulative vascular damage. To highlight the key differences, let's look at the causes. Alzheimer's is primarily due to neurodegeneration from protein buildup, while vascular dementia results from impaired blood flow due to vascular damage or strokes. When it comes to symptoms, Alzheimer's usually starts with memory loss and progresses to overall cognitive decline. In contrast, vascular dementia often begins with issues related to executive functions like planning and attention. Progression also varies between the two. Alzheimer's disease progresses steadily and irreversibly, whereas vascular dementia may progress in a stepwise manner, with sudden declines following vascular events. Diagnosing Alzheimer's involves identifying specific brain changes and ruling out other causes. In contrast, diagnosing vascular dementia often includes imaging techniques like magnetic resonance imaging to show evidence of vascular damage or strokes. Interestingly, both conditions can coexist, a scenario known as mixed dementia, which complicates diagnosis and treatment. Understanding these differences is crucial for accurate diagnosis and effective management. While treatments for Alzheimer's focus on managing symptoms and slowing progression, managing vascular dementia emphasizes controlling vascular risk factors like hypertension and diabetes to prevent further brain injury. In all cases, it is essential to seek professional medical evaluation and personalized care to address the unique needs of individuals with dementia.